Welcome back, Noel. We set some records today. Two records today from National Weather Service Marquette. Ben, our record high, as you see on the Almanac data, 47 degrees. That beats the old record high of 42 set in 1933. And we had a low temperature at the Weather Forecast Office, 30 degrees, and that'll beat the old record warm low, 25 degrees set in 1998. So we had some record warm lows, and that'll add to the three that we had or, uh, just several days ago, the 25th, 26th, and 27th. We had had some lows around that 30 degree mark and that beats the warm low records for then as the, the dates are noted here as you see. Surprisingly though, above average for our snow and we could contribute that to that mid winter or that mid January winter storm across the region. 47.4 inches of snow at the weather forecast office is just over five above that average. But we're still set for some warm temperatures as you see that that jet stream is well towards west central Canada. We're going to see that crest over to upper Michigan to this weekend and ahead of it. We've got a little wintry system. It's to the north of the UP, but it looks to bring a light wintry mix tonight through Thursday across the region, while at the same time, will be above average with our temperature trend. We'll take you to future radar and temperature because there's going to be something interesting coming overnight. We'll be partly to mostly cloudy towards the evening. And as we get into Thursday morning, that system will drop down a mix from north to south. It'll be light in intensity, but your temperatures to start your Thursday will be around the 30s, might even be above freezing for much of the UP. We get into Thursday afternoon. If you're heading towards the Lake Superior shore, temperatures will range from the upper 20s to lower 30s. If you want to get that warm 40 degree temperature high, head towards the southernmost portions of upper Michigan. We get some light snow across the northern half of the region Thursday and a mix towards the south before we get drier and a bit warmer into Friday. Your lows for Friday morning will be a bit colder for some areas, especially over the western UP, could drop down to the teens and even for the eastern counties too to start your Friday for a sunnier turn and warmer towards the weekend. Precipitation forecast tonight through tomorrow will be overall light, but factor in that light wintry mix, factor in the constant snow melt, and we got some slippery conditions to watch out for. There could even be areas of poor visibility with some patchy drizzle, patchy fog, and some gusty winds from the north. Keep a firm grip on the wheel along with those slippery spots. The wind gusts will be anywhere from 25 to even 30 miles per hour if you're near the Lake Superior shore tomorrow. With temperature lows tonight around the 30 degree mark. And remember, this is going to be around that time frame before the sun rises. Uh, tomorrow's highs, you're going to get to 40 degrees if you head towards the southernmost portions of upper Michigan. Here's a temperature outlook as we look into mid February. This is where we could get a temperature feel, get, make it feel more like the UP winters that we're used to. Temperatures will range around the 20s or even lower, and we'll keep, in, keep an eye on those snow chances, because we know we got UP 200 coming up mid-February. If we get a winter storm ahead of that, that might favor the conditions for the race. TV6 extended forecast, well, we could get some 40s and 50s for Saturday, Ben. Well, it's certainly uh, not what we're used to, huh? Not something we're used to, but you mentioned your birthday coming up this month, right? For yeah. February, that is. And yeah, maybe your return, uh, my birthday, will bring good tidings of good snow. I count on that good luck for you, man. All right, thanks, Noel. And remember, on the free TV.